Hello everyone, the Serious Kaku Demon here. Welcome back to the Serpent Resurrection talk through. Uh, now, uh, this is all post-commentary stuff because, well, the Dothy Marshes was giving me a lot of trouble when trying to do it uh, with live commentary, so I had to concentrate uh, on getting out of the Dothy Marshes. Mostly because of this area. All the Chaos Serpents and uh, Acid Imps uh, shooting at you uh, at a fast rate. Uh, it also doesn't help that uh, there's uh, lots of Stalkers inside the marsh waters and uh, most of them are uh, the Acid Shooters. Now, uh, here is where I use a Fear Scroll. The Fear Scroll doesn't completely prevent the monsters from shooting fireballs and such, but uh, it does uh, slow down their uh, rate of fire for such attacks. Also, uh, the Fear Scroll's ability to allow you to uh, cause enemies to be paralyzed with fear once you get close enough to them uh, when the uh, Fear Scroll is active is also another nice bonus. I would have had a lot more trouble getting out of this uh, area without the Fear Scroll active. Now, originally, uh, I took out those uh, stalkers with uh, poison vials, but uh, it wasn't as effective, and uh, it was a waste of uh, poison vials to begin with. Besides, uh, any health that I lost uh, from the Stalkers fighting them the way I did just now uh, is negligible due to the fact that uh, I could just use the uh, Serpent Staff's uh, life leeching abilities to get uh, all my health back. Yes, I was able to get all my health back uh, at this point. What I did was uh, I leeched the health from both of the uh, Centaurs inside the houses. The house uh, locked with the swamp lock and uh, the unlocked uh, house. Both houses contain uh, potions of life and uh, armor pieces, but uh, remember, uh, Braxis the Cleric cannot use uh, the Falcon Shield at all. He can only use the Platinum Helmet. Uh, Now, uh, I used some magic rings, a green mana battery, and a uh, blue mana battery before I set foot in the Dothy Volcano. Now, speaking of the Dothy Volcano, I was glad when I finally got to this map. After the hell I've been through in the Dothy Marshes, uh, the Dothy Volcano is a breath of fresh air for me. The Dothy Volcano only has one secret, and it cannot be revealed through the option of uh, showing all secrets even when they're not found in the options menu for Jesus uh, Doom. That's right, you will not see uh, any sectors in uh, pink or purple if you have that option on. Because of how the uh, secret is hidden uh, and stuck in this map, now, believe it or not, uh, you can get to a key uh, very quickly uh, from the start of the map. I just went that way just to get some mana and stuff. Now, on the way uh, to the area, I level up again uh, after uh, killing this fire elemental. And I use both of my skill points on uh, Dexterity. Now, uh, I wasn't sure if I should have uh, put one point on Dexterity, then put uh, the other point on uh, Constitution. But of course, I, I was feeling brave when I uh, recorded this, so uh, I used both points on uh, Dexterity. Of course, uh, more Dexterity means uh, I'm going to be uh, running faster and jumping higher, and uh, that helps uh, speed-wise in this talk-through. Uh, 
spend uh, less parts uh, getting to a certain area and stuff, uh, but then again, uh, it may not make a difference, but still. Extra running speed and stuff will help uh, evade enemies and such. What I did here first uh, was clear out all the enemies because I don't want them getting in my way uh, when I uh, decide to uh, leave this uh, area after getting the key and other things uh, as well. I should also note that, uh, as usual, the key is a booby trap, meaning as soon as you grab the key, uh, it'll set off a trap or ambush uh, with monsters coming out. Just like uh, every key I picked up, with the exception of maybe the bronze and silver keys in the Eastern Shore. Grabbing the cave key incurs the wrath of some Chaos Serpents. Brown Chaos Serpents. Of course it is strange though, because the only Chaos Serpents we've encountered so far are uh, the Brown Chaos Serpents that spit out the green fireballs. Now, uh, I know there's uh, lots of people out there that uh, consider the uh, fireballs, gas balls, and that, uh, they're poisonous. This is not true. The fireballs are green, but, uh, they do not, uh, cause poison damage. They, in fact, cause, uh, fire damage, just like the green Chaos Serpent's fireballs. Also, another thing, uh, to, uh, solidify this fact is, that uh, if you get killed uh, by a green fireball, uh, you burn up instead of just uh, slump down like normal. Of course, uh, the death obituary says that uh, the player has been gassed by a chaos serpent. That seems rather erroneous uh, to me as well. And, uh... If you've been uh, saving uh, potions of fire protection and uh, have bought one uh, at the uh, item shop back at the Eastern Shore, uh, you should have a maximum of five by now after picking up that uh, potion of fire protection back there. Now right here, uh, I thought uh, I had a maximum uh, amount of uh, mana batteries and uh, was almost about to... Uh, Select the mana battery and use one before picking up that blue mana battery. Turns out I didn't need to do that. Also, I did a lot of quick saving here, even though I never died a single time in this entire map. That's right. I did a lot of quick saving, but I never died at all. In this entire part, even. Uh, watch through the rest of this uh, video and you'll see I never died again in this entire part. Guess I must have been so concentrated on trying to get out of the uh, Dothy Marshes without dying this time. And also uh, due to the fact that, uh, well, uh, the Dothy Volcano kicks so much ass and is, uh, incredibly fun, despite it being hard, but it's uh, more of the uh, funnish type of hard. That is, uh, it challenges you, but it doesn't uh, go the extremeness and hardness, uh, like the uh, Dothy Marshes just did. Uh, all those stalkers, most of them using acid balls as projectiles, and all those fireball shooters included as well. They killed the map for me. Dothy Volcano, on the other hand, uh, is so much fun because, well, uh, it's uh, easy to take out all the enemies here and none of them uh, pull any dirty tricks on you. And you never have to traverse through any uh, stalker-infested waters. I should 
also point out that uh, there are times where it seems like I'm a bit lost. Well, uh, that's because, well, the Dothy Volcano is a huge network of tunnels and stuff uh, with uh, lava traps and such. And if I didn't uh, emphasize this enough, uh, the lava is instant death if you fall in. did my business in that room, uh, I had to take out those Aphrids first. I will talk about more about that room uh, when I get to it, uh, and do it for real. Uh, that opening there, uh, we're going to be heading that way later, because that way leads to the Chasm of Fire. And, uh, the pathway is really bad there, and requires a lot of quick saving and trial and error to get across. But for now, uh, let's go to this room I was talking about. I do the most dumbest move uh, possible in this part. I felt too confident in my skills of, uh, trying to land uh, hits with the Firestorm, but, uh, I completely forget that, uh, the Firestorm doesn't reach far enough to get that Chaos Serpent in the distance. I should have been using the Raven Staff the whole time, and, uh, also save uh, my green mana for other enemies. Now, in this part, uh, well, I needed uh, two jump boots uh, to uh, get to everything in this room. That is because, well, the 20-second uh, time limit for the jump boots uh, certainly doesn't help. If it were uh, 30 seconds long or something, uh, I would have only needed one pair of jump boots. Anyways, I grabbed some items, uh, including a summon scroll, some magic rings, the flame mask, some mana batteries, and uh, I also believe uh, the Porcolator as well. This is actually the first uh, map which I encounter a Porcolator outside of an item shop. Now, uh, I'm not sure if I'm gonna be able to find any use for the Porcolator later on. Probably gonna end up having the same fate as the Discs of Propulsion which, uh, it'll be rarely used. Uh, but, uh, if I do run into a situation where I'm gonna need the Porcolator, well, uh, you'll probably find out, uh, soon then, anyways. And, uh, this part's almost over. Uh, I take out that Lair Dragon and then pick up the Potion of Life, uh, and then, around here, I, uh, go to the menu and save my game. So, uh, thank you all for watching this part of the Serpent Resurrection talk through. Uh, next time we explore more of the Dothy Volcano, and then visit the Chasm of Fire. See y'all then, everyone.